New at 10, a San Francisco man is planning to open the city's first non-alcoholic speakeasy. This will include more than 100 mixers and drinks, all without alcohol. As KTV's Alyssa Harrington tells us, the bar owner says there's a huge demand for boozeless beverages, and he calls his speakeasy the bar of the future. Let's see what we got. Joshua James shakes up a mezcal madre, a signature drink at Ocean Beach Cafe in San Francisco. But this drink and all beer, wine, and spirits here are completely 100% non-alcoholic. Everybody's getting in the game like Lagunitas. These are the top guys in the space. James is the owner of the cafe and quit drinking two years ago. He carries roughly 100 different types of zero-proof drinks, including craft beers. There's even some big brand names like Budweiser. The non-drinker didn't have a lot of options and like they were okay with seltzer water or Diet Coke or whatever. And um, all of a sudden, all of these products came out. So that was a huge part of it. But there was another part, and, and that was COVID happened. James believes the pandemic got people to start prioritizing their health. He's noticing a huge demand for boozeless drinks, whether customers are looking to cut back, quit drinking, or are sober curious. James now plans to open the city's first non-alcoholic speakeasy. It will be invite only with events as well. There is a shift in culture itself. There's a shift in drinking culture, which is a subset of that. And there, the, the leaders of this industry and food and beverage professionals and all the movers and shakers in the non-alcoholic beverage industry are going to be invited here to, to talk about those things. The speakeasy is named Temperance Bar after the temperance movement to limit drinking. Across town in the Mission, there's a non-alcoholic vending machine at Hawker Fair called a Nano Bar. You scan a QR code, you walk through the prompts, and it uh, allows you to open the door and you grab a can of your choice. General Manager Dolly Valdez Bautista says they are constantly restocking. She says even though dry January is over, the trend is sticking around. Non-alcoholic drinks right now are about 10% of our total beverage sales. Nielsen data predicts buzzless beverages will be one of the biggest trends of 2022. Last year alone, consumers spent $3.3 billion on no and low alcohol products. Italian bubbly. I'm Alyssa Harrington, KTVU, Fox 2 News.